he's been saying as far as the violence of this society. And But it's very hard to say anything when you haven't done anything about it. Confront all the backward ideas and backward things about this culture and this society, overcome them, become a force for change, and bring about that change. But it won't happen by wishing it were so or by proclaiming it. It will only happen through direct struggle and confrontation. We no longer wish to be treated as statistics. I think it's a common mistake to think that violence is a choice in political matters. Violence exists in certain social situations, and it's not a question of choosing to be violent or nonviolent. When you're putting forward the uh, idea of revolution, you have a responsibility to build in from the very beginning the realization that no revolution can take place successfully without an armed confrontation with the, with the state. The imperialist power will fight as long as it can with the most advanced technological weapons that it has. And I, and I feel that uh, pacifism and nonviolence becomes an excuse for not struggling, for not fulfilling what I feel is a human obligation in this world to, uh, to bring about revolutionary change and to destroy the imperialist system. Why haven't the popular struggles in this country been more successful? Why hasn't there been a revolution? One of the main reasons, well, well the main reason, is that the people are divided against each other. The people who run the country are very good at this. They, they've been managed to turn men against women. They've managed to turn white collar workers against blue collar workers. But mainly, for 400 years, they've managed to turn white people against black people. Violence is a part of America's culture. It is as American as Jerry Pine. Pine. You, you can't win. It can't work well. What can you accomplish? There's nothing you can do. The United States government is so powerful. What you do doesn't make any difference. You don't matter. Um, and I think the revolutionary lesson is just the opposite. What people do makes all the difference. What people do or don't do determines the outcome of things. Well, the state government is not invisible. It doesn't exist for all time, and it's not going to exist for all time. It's full of resistance. We have gone on your offensive, and we have fallen the shots now. We no longer wish to be treated as statistics.
Try 
poetry and get the hell out Should be labeled, I am proud of what this black about 